Hi, in this video, we're going to practice some English words and phrases. Try shadowing me by repeating the words immediately after I say them. Let's practice. Evolve, 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 evolve. Compensation, compensation, compensation. Achieve, achieve, achieve. Manipulate, manipulate, manipulate. Pretense, pretense, pretense. Accept, accept, accept. Adapt, adapt, adapt. Adaptation, adaptation, adaptation. Proper, proper, proper. Appropriate, appropriate, appropriate. Countable, countable, countable. Uncountable, uncountable uncountable countless 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 right 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 light 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 now let's reverse the order light 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 right 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 away right away right away i'll get it done right away i'll get it done right away i'll get it done right away right on right on right on your answer is right on. Your answer is right on. Your answer is right on. Right on time. Right on time. Right on time. The delivery was made right on time. The delivery was made right on time. The delivery was made right on time. Same day delivery. Same day delivery. Same day delivery. In the right place at the right time. In the right place at the right time. In the right place at the right time. She was in the right place at the right time to seize the opportunity. She was in the right place at the right time to seize the opportunity. She was in the right place at the right time to seize the opportunity. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Light. 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 See the light. See the light. See the light. It took me a while to see the light on this matter. It took me a while to see the light on this matter. It took me a while to see the light on this matter. Light up one's life. Light up one's life. Light up one's life. Your smile lights up my life. Your smile lights up my life. Your smile lights up my life. In light of. In light of. In light of. In light of this information. I need to change my plans. In light of this information, I need to change my plans. In light of this information, I need to change my plans. Make light of. Make light of. Make light of. You shouldn't make light of this serious situation. You shouldn't make light of this serious situation. You shouldn't make light of this serious situation. Take lightly. Take lightly. Take lightly. This is not a matter to be taken lightly. This is not a matter to be taken lightly. This is not a matter to be taken lightly. Shed light on. Shed light on. Shed light on. Can you shed any light on this issue? Can you shed any light on this issue? Can you shed any light on this issue? Come to light. Come to light. Come to light. It has come to light that he's leaving the company. It has come to light that he's leaving the company. It has come to light that he's leaving the company. Give the green light. Give the green light. Give the green light. The FDA has given the green light for the new drug to be sold in pharmacies. The FDA has given the green light for the new drug to be sold in pharmacies. The FDA has given the green light for the new drug to be sold in pharmacies. Both, give a green light, and, give the green light, are grammatically correct, but they can be used slightly differently depending on context. 1. Give the green light. This is generally used when you're referring to a specific situation or decision that's already been discussed or implied. It means to give permission for something to proceed. For example, the manager gave the green light for us to start on the project. 2. Give a green light. This is often used in more general contexts, when you're not referring to a specific decision or situation. For example, 
The government tends to give a green light to infrastructure projects. In terms of common usage, give the green light is probably used more frequently than give a green light. However, it really depends on the specific context of your conversation or writing. Show off, show off, show off, boast, 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 brag, brag, brag. Raft, 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 left, left, left. Now, let's reverse the order. Left, left, left. Raft, raft, raft. Let's discuss how to pronounce raft and left. The explanations provided here are based on general American English pronunciation. Starting with raft. To pronounce the R sound, your tongue should not touch the roof of your mouth. Instead, it should curl up slightly and point towards the alveolar ridge the bump behind your upper teeth, but not touch it. The sides of your tongue should be in contact with the insides of your upper molars. Next, we have the vowel sound in raft. This is a short vowel sound as in cat. Your mouth should be open wide and relaxed, with your tongue flat and low in the mouth. Now for the F sound in raft. For this sound, Lightly bite down on your lower lip with your upper teeth while exhaling lightly. Lastly, we come to the T sound in raft. This is an unvoiced consonant sound made by blocking air from exiting the vocal tract by placing the tip of the tongue against the alveolar ridge, the bumpy area behind your top teeth. When you release that blockage, it creates a T sound. Moving on to left. Firstly, let's talk about L. To make this sound, place the tip of your tongue against the alveolar ridge, the bump just behind your upper front teeth. Air should flow along either side of your tongue as you voice out through your vocal cords. Next is where we see a difference from raft when pronouncing vowel sounds. In left, the vowel sound is the same short vowel sound as in bed. Unlike the the vowel sound in raft, which has a wide and relaxed mouth position, the vowel sound in left requires a slightly more closed mouth. Your tongue should be in the front middle part of your mouth, just below the alveolar ridge. Finally, we have the F and T sounds, which are pronounced just as they were in raft. In conclusion, when pronouncing raft and left, pay close attention to how you position your tongue and control airflow through your mouth. A raft of, a raft of, a raft of, rafts of, rafts of, rafts of. The phrases a raft of and rafts of are commonly used in the United States. They are idiomatic expressions that mean a lot of or many. While these phrases may occasionally appear in formal contexts, they are primarily used in informal speech and writing. Examples. 1. I have a raft of ideas for my next project. 2. I have a raft of options to consider. 3. Rafts of people are waiting at the entrance. 4. He has proposed a raft of new policies. 5. His company is facing a raft of challenges including rising costs and supply chain issues. Please note that while these phrases are common, they might not be as widely recognized or understood by non-native English speakers or those unfamiliar with the idiom. Left, left, left. Left over, left over, left over. Left-handed, left-handed, left-handed. Right-handed, right-handed, right-handed. Thanks for watching.